Hello my darlings, happy Wednesday to all of you and welcome back to Let's Build the World. And welcome to a brand new build. We are starting on fairy cloth antiques today, my darlings. In the district where I'm thinking of putting a bit more of a retail element. I've had a few ideas of how I want the actual shop to look. Little blue in the background there. We're going to cover him up now. Oh, he's noticed, he's noticed. We're going to cover him up now with a little example of what I want the shop front to kind of look like. Classy, kind of sort of brick vibes with kind of black accent windows, lots of greenery on the outside. Just a classy establishment, really, is Berry Cloth Antiques. So that's what we're going to do today. Now, as always, with the kind of part one, we don't tend to get a lot done. We're going to concentrate on the main frontage facade area so this is what graham owns this is his passion his livelihood um and i want to do a kind of salvage yard in the back as well with lots of kind of garden sort of um antiques and vintage stuff i really want that to be at the forefront as well and i want space to put in a van as well i would imagine he's got this big white van that he goes around and picks up all these antiques from all these stately homes and other places think of salvage hunters if you if you've ever watched that with i forget what he's called what is he called again you know who you know who i mean if you're in the uk and you watch it um think that kind of vibe that's what i want the shop to kind of like portray so that's what we're gonna do so let's flop on over and stop building so then my dears here we are in a new area of brindleton bay we have not built here yet we've still got quite a few lots to fill up in this space my darlings so this main area here is going to be your main kind of retail area this is where i really want um a couple more or maybe a restaurant that kind of vibe up here we're going to be doing like a pasty shop slash restaurant kind of vibe um but this is where we're this is where we're building today and this is the lot where we're going to be putting berry cloth antiques yes we are i've pulled out a few things that i just think would match in well um with this particular build um and we're going to get started we're going to get started straight away i'm going to move you so you're not distracting me i will turn you this way though so you guys can kind of sort of see what we're going for here um here we are hello how are you wednesday is upon us it is on us it is sitting on our face um and i'm for it i'm absolutely for it already i've had a like a chilled start today i would say a nice chilled start how was your wednesdays started that's what i would like to know thank you answers down below <laughs> you don't have to answer i promise <laughs> it's just me being a boob an absolute breast right we're continuing on um this is the kind of sort of shop front i want i really want the door on this kind of like angle here so this might move across a little bit more in a minute it's not going to be a huge shop in itself really um, um today what we're doing is just concentrating on the main facade so i'm going to do the little salvage yard bit bit back here there's enough room and stuff back there for it i'm going to move this though i want a kind of i want it to be kind of maybe like there instead that's like a three i'm thinking of a pavement around here that's a two and that i could do a two yeah, we'll do a two. I'm going to put the start mapping in the pavement because I'm going to be raising this up just by one, just so it almost looks like it's got this curb sort of moment. Uh, and the main reasons for that is we don't have anything that matches in perfectly with this brick. Um, so it's very annoying. Um, so I'm going to just do my own. I'm just going to do my own. And that is the mantra for today. Yes, it is. Um, right, I'm going to flop this. I don't know if this is a little bit too small. Um, you need to go there so I can fill up that space. Uh, no, I reckon that will be okay. Yeah, as soon as I get this side in as well. I think it will match in rather lovely. And then we're going to lift that up by one, I think. Let's just have a little goose. Just so it gives that kind of like, yeah, that kind of vibe at the front. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. I'm changing it. I think what I want to do maybe is go for a curved piece on the front there. Um... Let me just short it. In fact, I'm just going to get rid of it that way. And then I'll just put the wall back in. Um, excuse you. Wall. Here we are. Lovely. Stunning. Cover girl. Oh, here we go. Here we bloody go. Uh, let's map that back in again. So if I cross you to there. You to there, my love. And then you. Stunning. There, that's better. Yeah. Yeah, we'll go for a curved moment in front instead. Okay. Okay. 
okay stunning absolutely for it going to do the same up here as well we're going to go up another level i reckon there will be different aspects lots of antiques sofas uh oh actually i was thinking oh we'll do that in a minute i'm just thinking we were gonna bet i was gonna bay the windows out a little bit there but we'll do that together in just a in just a minge right so let me whiff all this all the way down we'll flop that around excuse you oh, i've been building a lot today love so you're probably going to get lots of mistakes of me um with me today i will say that yes yes i do believe so i do believe i enjoy that we're going to come down to here and i'm going to bay this window out slightly i'm just wondering how many of these i can flop in without it hmm i kind of want it to go up to there we're going to get the brick on first ah uh, the only problem with that is going to be offset to where i can bay the window so maybe if i do it there instead yeah that would work and then I could probably, I might have to whiffle this out a little bit here. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> no idea. Absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Yeah, I do enjoy that. I do enjoy that. It's almost making me want to come in here one. And just shorten it down slightly. Let me just see the floor space. Yeah, that's ample, ample enough room there, darling gonna do like a high wall moment here now i know i said i wanted to give him his own little truck to be in here but it just wouldn't make sense there's no um connect they can't even get out if they did have a truck so maybe i can park like a lorry over on this side or something maybe we'll do that is that a path that's a path oh it's a bit crap or maybe we can't maybe we won't maybe we shan't you know yeah it still looks a little bit too small no, nope, I'm going to keep it as it is. I was just, I was going to make it a little bit longer again, but it just didn't work. I had a little player test of it. Right. Okay. We're going to go for this brick as well. I'm thinking I might do that down the bottom and white at the top. I'm unsure of that yet. I'm unsure of that. Uh, oh, I've just thought if we're going to be baying the windows out, we're going to need a thicker. We're going to, I'm going to move the whole house. We're going to need a thicker that's gonna delete over there but oh well um path like a three wide path so if i put you to there lovely and let me just thicken this up first to a three because the bay window is going to come up there and again okay and now i can move it just so i can get this into the right position uh i'm gonna flop you to about there i think let me see this let me have a little little goosey at that. Yeah, that's better. Okay. And let's bay out this window here. So I've really wanted this to come out here because I'm thinking like greenery on the top, maybe with some like sort of fancy signage um, that I have no idea how I'm going to do yet. No idea. Absolutely no idea. And the main reasons for doing these bay windows, I, bay windows, bay windows, I just think it would really work having... I could have just done that rather than what I just did. Um, like a little stage here where, where we can put, hire it up with a platform and then you could be able to see and look in to where that is. I'm kind of feeling that idea. In fact, I'm going to do it now while we're here and that will give me an idea of space as well. Uh, that will get rid of the wall because Sims. Um, and then I'm going to do it all the way across to here. Like so. It's just going to get rid of all the walls as well. So we're just going to keep going until we... Um, I've got all the platforms in, then I'll just put the walls back on. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. And they're all the way to there, my love. I think it's just the one here, isn't it? There we go. Let me see. Let me see what we're working with there. Yeah, I think that could work. I think that could work. Some lovely greenery up here. I'm going to put a half wall up there. Maybe just like the shortest half wall, just so it kind of like finishes that off nicely there we'll put some soil in there and we're going to do some greenery in it uh, and i'm thinking i'm going to do a little like awning for the actual door here don't know what door i'm going to use up there just yet uh, i am however going to try out a white at the top here rather than doing a brick we're going to see how that would look um i'm a little bit apprehensive it's not going to look good but we're going to give it a good old go darlings a good old go indeed Right, you're on to there, my love. You probably can you even see what I'm doing here? Yeah, you should be able to. Uh, and then 
Let's get the brick. Where's the painted brick? We have got that textured painted brick, but I think it looks quite red. Oh no, that could be nice actually. Oh, is that going to do all the inside there? It will. I mean, that could work. The lighting on these lots are absolutely terrible. Um, I mean, that one there is fine, but... Eh. Yeah, I think this could work. Signage here. Some greenery coming down from there. And the windows I wanted to use up here was these ones. I think these would look good at the top. Maybe in black, maybe in white. It depends on how and what I'm going to go for. I was going to do a window there. But I think I might put a little bit of signage up there as well. I'm unsure just yet. Uh, and then I'm going to do one on this side. I'm going to do one on that side. Oh, that does look nice with the white at the top. I do like that. Let's come back to the daylight colours. I do kind of like that. So now I'm debating on doing signage there or putting a window there. Because I do want an awning on that bit. I'm unsure at what kind of awning just yet. I might even put these over the windows on the outside. Uh, that could look nice. I did pull this out and test these, but I didn't test them on the bay window. Oh, that does look nice. I do like that. It's missing a window on this side, though. It really is. But the window that <sighs> supposedly... it does not. I don't think it's supposed to match these, or it's just an overlooked thing once again with the Sins team. Um with get to work but there is a window a smaller one but the panel's a little bit too high to match in with these and um, but i'm going to test it out and i'm also going to go and find a door so give me a sec found the door which is the one from get to work and the nice thing about this door is when you put it on a diagonal it puts in these two extra windows that just really pulls that place beautifully together and i'm wondering now that i've done that because the windows didn't work on the sides here but 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 it might work here because I think that's going to be the same height as the door. Oh, that's not too bad. That is not too bad at all. Let me see this. Oh, yes. Colour me and tickle my tuppence. I'm full of that. I am. Still needs an awning here, though. I'm wondering if I can slot these into place here or would that look strange? I mean, I could... Oh, no, that's going to come through into there, isn't it? Is it? Let me see. Let me, let me, it's just, eh. Are you going to, are you going to be inside? Oh, I thought it was going to, ignore the ceilings. No, it's going to creep inside. It's a shame about that there. I mean, what I could do. <gasps> oh, I've just had a little thought, loves. I've just had a little thought. What about, oh, yes, I'm doing this. I think this might work. We could do our own little, like, just canopy area over the top here. Wondering if it would look okay. Hopefully it will. I'm thinking, like, here and then just over there. Like that. Oh, like that. Stunning. I could even raise... I could even... <gasps> oh. <laughs> look at me getting excited. I could even do this. Oh, I'm for it. Yes, this is going to work. This will work all the way along there, darlings. Yeah, that's much better. Obviously, I need to put in a little trim. I've got an itchy moustache. What does that mean? <laughs> it means you've got an itchy moustache, Aid. It literally does. <laughs> uh, me and my friends do it all the time. I've got an itchy left hand. What does that mean? It means that you've got an itchy left hand, darling. That's what it means. Yes, I'm into it. Yeah, I'm into that. Absolutely into it. Have you seen me? I've got... Wait there. I need to scratch. And why is my nose so shiny? I mean, how rude. I have got oily skin, but they do say, and I've said this before on the channel, oily skin ages better. So I'm more than happy to have shiny, oily skin. Thank you. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk once again. Do I want to get rid of that? No, I'm going to keep that on there. I'm going to keep that on there, but I am going to colour this wall trim. Um, let's go for the stone. Not that it makes any difference because they all look exactly the same. Shit. That's how they look. Yes. Yeah. I'm feeling that. With some lovely light green. I might even put some lights up there actually. Some like lovely old lights. Um, we're going to pretend that this says 1840 and not 1940. Do I want to size that down? 
No, I kind of liked the the full size of it, but I do think it needs to just come up a little minge there. Yeah, okay. Right, let's get a roof on this bad boy, shall we? So let's get this roof going. Um, How are we going to do this? What kind of roof do I go in with one of these here? Let's have a little goosey-goosey. Get it up a little bit higher than that, my darling. Maybe. I don't think it needs to be coming out that far. I think you can go into about there. Oh, no, because it kind of... No, 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 that would be fine, actually. Back again, please. Back again. Thank you. We are going to raise you up just a little bit, though. Like that. In with one of these. Half gabled. Half gabled. I've never known the roof types in The Sims. <laughs> Just guess them. I'm like, yeah, that looks like a roof. <laughs> we'll do that one. <laughs> flaps in, darlings. Tuck your flaps in. This is not a place for flaps out. Well, actually, do what you want with your flaps, you know? They are your flaps, after all. Now, do I go that way with this? Or... Hmm, I need a little think. So, what I had to do, I did the half um, gabled here, here, and here on the front pieces. And then we did the half hipped roof, which is this one, um, on these back pieces here. And then I just lifted this up as a platform. We're just going to do a flat roof on top. Maybe with a chimney somewhere as well. I think that could look quite cute on this build. Um, I don't know whether to modernize the ceiling. Ceiling? The roof tiles. Or to go for a really nice just black slate. Let's have a look at the slate as well. Oh, you could work actually. You could really work here as well. Because that kind of like modernizes and keeps it traditional. That's nice. I do enjoy that. But I was thinking doing the slate. No, I like that. I like that. As soon as the slate was on it. Oh, I don't know. What do I like? Who am I? Not a grey. It definitely needs to be black to tie in some of the black accents down below. Um, That does make the building look older. I think I'm going to go for this one. I do love this. Oh, I don't know. That looks lovely. Do you know what? We're going to go for this one. We're going to keep it wavy, loves. And that's what it is. This, the um, roof tile is called keep it wavy. That's what we're going to do. We're going to give them some black trims here darlings absolutely black trims all the way along thank you and then here i'm gonna i'm going to um maybe this one i'm just gonna color that tree yeah there we go that's better and then on the top there annoyingly i hate that you can't put like roof textures on flat surfaces and um, one of you guys mentioned that recently as well and it annoys me too i would like to see it in the game um, maybe the rubber, because it's got a bit of texture on it. Or I could do some kind of like slaty tile moment up here. Oh, that works. Yeah, we'll do that. That tile was from Dine Out, by the way. Never utilise that tile more, and I don't know why, because it's not too bad, is it? That would look great in a bathroom. I need to remember this. I forget about stuff so much. I really do. Yeah, that looks sweet. That does look sweet. We just need to bring in some more details now. Um, and I'm thinking signage, but I love that this is the sign, really. I do love that that there is the sign. But I might just do some posh writing up on top here and here. Um, yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Using the dine out one. I'm wondering if I could size it down just one. And maybe the same with you as well. I mean, you sit a bit funny. Do you, do you, are you kind of stay on there when it's that size? <gasps> do you know what? I kind of prefer it with this sized down. Um, and this like signature sign. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. And I also put the um, awnings on this side as well because it was missing them. Oh, it's coming together rather deliciously, I think. Needs green. Needs a lot of greenery. We're going to be planting. I'm going to do hedges up here, I think. Um, and maybe those like sharp um individual ones oh should we go a bit like free the only problem with doing this is that i think oh no i don't know let me see that oh that does look nice 
Oh, the Hedge of Dreams coming in to save us once again. Yeah, it will mean that I'll, I'll get rid of these and I'm going to try. Oh, God, look, look, I didn't color on the inside. Um, It will mean that I'll get rid of those little half walls there, but that doesn't matter so much. All right, let's get down to that level. So we're not jumping around all over the bloody show. And I'm going to paint the inside of these just so we can definitely see that they've been done. And I'm, the Virgo in me is not crying. Yeah, I think we're going to use the Hedge of Dreams, loves. And we're going to do some of those hanging um baskets but i'm gonna try and make my own like i have before in the past with like the little like green shrubs uh just to make it look extra bougie i can imagine lots of tories come into this place i really can and, and that is not a good thing Joe. it's not a good thing <laughs> uh, what are we like on this channel tell you what we're like hoot absolute hoot darlings let me see this yeah the greenery is definitely gonna work there Oh, I'm feeling that. Absolutely feeling it. 100%. Absolutely here for it. Let's get down to that level. Get the grid on. Twist you around and size you down. Twist you around, please. Uh, excuse you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, I am going to size that sign down now, though, because this is kind of like just taken away. Yeah, we'll do We'll do it smaller. I it kept drawing my eye anyway because it was quite large. And at least it fits there quite nicely now into it here for it cover girl all of that you know what more can be said what more can be said apart from what i've just said <laughs> i might even climb some ivy out of this as well just up here and there on the build just think that would look nice oh, i'm into that absolutely into it i'm thinking some pillars out the front here but i don't know what pillars to use so let me have a little look through and see what i come up with i just went for the ones from get together i just think they suit just makes it look a little bit more structurally viable there. That was a very posh word for me to use. Structurally viable. Who do I think I am sometimes? Oh, right. I'm going to put it on a drain pipe. I'm going to flop one there. I'm going to flop one there as well. Um, For some reason, these don't like being connected at the top anymore. They always seem to fit on the bottom, which is weird. And what I mean by that is default I put the wall down now that would stay up like that and that's the default position of that you have to kind of go in and retouch it just ever so slightly and then it comes down weird sims what more can be said yeah i'm into that two lovely big lanterns on this side two old school wall lanterns um sorry i'm just maneuvering my arm there darlings my little armrest um, is it outside lights? I think they are the ones that I'm thinking of. And they're quite large. These ones. I love these. Yes. Oh, it's going to fit a dream there. One there. And well, that one there is a little bit off balance for some reason. I'm going to flop you to about there. Off balance to the logo anyway. Just a little bit more in, my love. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, you're lower than the other one, you little shit. I can see you. Don't think I can't. Don't think I can. There were so many people pooing their pants about um the two sofas that merged together last time. And what they they belong together. They belong together. That is all I can say. That is all I can say. No, I just totally missed it. So thank you for thank you for pointing it out. Because I missed it. Um, yeah, lovely. I'm thinking greenery here. In the form of two like pointy trees. That we'll probably have to make our own for that. So let's do that now. I'm wondering if the shadow is going to be weird on that, though. Where are those little pointy... Uh, these ones. I, I could make two of my own. Oh, is that a bit small? Shall I do two bigger ones? Um, I think that might be a bit too big now. And that's a bit too small. Oh, that's annoying. I mean, I'm going to put them in a plant pot anyway. Maybe it will work. Let's try it. One there. Oh, excuse you. And another one there. Ignore the floor as well. We haven't done anything with that just yet. And then I'm going to put them in two of those lovely little planters. The darker, the better. Not so much black. We're going to go for dark brown. Right there. Oh, yeah. This is actually quite working. Actually, quite working. This is actually quite working. That was how I decided to say that. Oh dear. Yeah, that looks nice, actually. I do like that. I do. And then we're going to try and do that little moment that we've done 
ever so many times, but it just works. It just works, you know? It's a bit like a Bethesda game. It just works. It really does. Until it doesn't. Because <laughs> I've been playing Fallout 4 and it does not work. <laughs> There's still so many bugs in that game, uh, uh, but it will never stop me not loving it. And that goes for a lot of Bethesda games. Um, is they higher? They're slightly higher, aren't they? Yeah. We're going to bring you down just a little tuppency tad. Not a tuppency tad, Aiden. I don't mind the flowers here, actually. The flowers look quite cute. But what I was thinking, where's that big bulbous bush? There we are. And then you size these down. I think it's about that size. Get that grid on. Come down here so I don't have to lift you up too much. Whiffle you up to there. And then it almost looks like those, like pretentious hanging baskets that you see on the front of posh yes we're gonna do that um that you see on the front of like posh restaurants and whatnot you know you know the ones i mean you know what i'm talking about those big posh bulbous bushes <laughs> uh not a posh bulbous bush Aiden. not a posh bulbous bush <laughs> oh what we like tell you what we like silly bums absolutely 100 percent Silly bums we are. Um, oh, also to all of you Twitch lovelies. Um, did, did I mention it yesterday? I don't know if I did. But I'm not going to be um, streaming tomorrow. I am going to watch Russell Brand live. Um, love me some Russell Brand. So I'm very looking forward to it. Um, so last stream is this evening. And we're playing through more of... Um, the Wolf Among Us, which I'm absolutely loving. Yeah, this is looking nice. I do like this. I think what I need to do is sort out what we're going to do with this pavement and how we're going to style it. I think we should stick in with this kind of tone so it doesn't look too jarring. Um, but we're going to struggle. So let me try and have a little look through and see what I can find. We're going to go for that base game one. That what I've tried so many. That is the least jarring. <laughs> that The difference between them. Um, there were a few things that I tried, but I just think that suits it. Now, also, I got rid of that curve because as soon as you put on a texture onto curved stuff at the minute, it just looks awful. It looks awful. It goes in a different direction. You cannot change it. It's stuck in that bloody direction. So I got rid of it. I got rid. I was not happy about it, but we did get rid. We got rid and I'm for it now. And that's all that matters, isn't it? But that shape's nice. It's quite a similar shape to the... Um, the harbour uh, fish and chip shop that we did. And what was it called again? The salt and anchor chippy. It was it's very similar shape to that, the like sort of side entrance, but it would make sense, wouldn't it? Being in the same kind of like area and whatnot. Um, but I'm for it. I'm for it. We've made a nice start today. And I think this is where I'm going to leave it today. Um, we've made a nice little start with berry cloth antiques. Tomorrow we're going to come back and we're going to make a start on other aspects of this. So around into the back the sort of salvage yard area and i kind of want to connect i might even do the salvage yard like around this side and extend this pathway down here so with this side here i'm going to try and connect it into the landscape a little bit more with like trees and stuff i think that's what i want to do here but i think we've made quite a nice little start with berry cloth today berry cloth antiques definitely need some more details and stuff going on um but we'll definitely come back to this tomorrow and finish it off then. Yes, we will not finish it off, but make more changes and whatnot. Anyway, I'm done. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye.